If you're not using Google Classroom or another method to make copies of your template document to all of your students or learners, you can actually force them to make a copy um, by editing the URL to the document just a little bit. So the first thing you'll want to do is make sure that you have it um, the permissions set so that anyone with the link can view so they don't get an error message. And with a Google Doc up here in the URL where it says slash edit, you want to keep that last forward slash and then just replace the word edit with the word copy, C-O-P-Y. And then you can copy and paste this link, um, create a bit.ly or however you're going to get it to um, your learners. When you give them that link with the word copy in it, then when they visit, they will immediately be taken to a page that looks like this. So they actually have to click make a copy before they can even view the document. So then when we're working in Google Slides, again, you'll want to make sure that the permission settings are set so that anyone with the link can view. And then up here, where we see slash edit and then a bunch of other uh, letters and numbers, if we change that to copy and hit enter again, we're forced to make a copy before we can actually see the document. If for some reason in your URL you do not see um, that slash edit, when you come in and hit the share button inside of your slideshow or document, then you can copy this link right here and paste it and then change it to the words copy in the address bar there. And be sure to visit me at talktechwithme.com for more.